great demon lord known as Greed. <laughs> and furthermore, that their portals lead to Greed's domain. Uh, a ludicrous notion, truly. Ludicrous. I believe it. I've seen worse. I've seen the demons of hell, bro. So, came too far off, am I right? Alright, well, that's good for that. So, got a new stronger bow. Um, yeah, okay, let's go up here and see what's up. Down the bottom here. Oh, look at this. Hello, guys. Well, wish I would have known about that sooner. This chick reminds me of Vane from LOL. I don't know why. Maybe it's because she uses crossbows and she's a demon hunter and she's a badass. Vane's UP though. They need to buff her. Anyway, enough about LOL. This is this is all about the D3 stain right here. Okay, let's continue onward, see if I missed anything. Alright, we're gonna have to go back there anyway, because we missed the room. Yeah, like I thought, it, it wrapped around, so we're going to have to go back down that way. Yep. I'm going to try and get all the books in this playthrough, too, so... I'm paranoid about missing things. <coughs> Oh, a new skill, rapid fire, that'll come in handy. Let me just, uh... Rapidly fire for 228% weapon damage is physical. Uh, yeah. Let's see how this works. That's pretty OP. It's like a machine gun out of my bow. Alright, well, it looks like we've gotten everything in here, so, uh, yeah, we can peace out. First dungeon of Diablo 3. Well, not the first one, but the first one of my life to play. The first of many. I'm hoping to finish the game for you guys. Um, if it can't be done, sorry, but Diablo 3 is a really long game. Like, my last playthrough took, like, 24 hours. So it's not going to be quick. So if you're willing to stick by and watch it all, then yeah, sure, I'll make a video. But I'm not sure everybody wants to watch 24 hours worth of games. Yeah, I think um, the other one might be better, to be completely honest with you. It does more damage, I can use it more often, so just keep him pale on. Masterwork shortbow, cloth tunic, health globes. Mm, no, I don't need that. what we got here. New boots. Seven magic armor boots. A sword that we can sell. And yeah, okay. 
to the next legacy, the Oryx Passage. This looks like a job for them. Da -da -da. Spoiler alert, Kane dies right here and the game ends. JK. I don't have enough hatred yet. Come at me, boy. I kill. Too great. The King Club of Angels. Alright. Uh, let me check down here real quick. I think this is where we leave out a bookcase. Yep. Disappeared. What witchery is this? All right. Looks like there's no other way. We must discuss the fallen star. Follow me, It's a little harsh, abomination, like, he's just a guy, here's my stash, um, if anybody knows what this is, liquid rainbow, I found it, and I have no idea what it does, so, yeah, I've been saving some of these high level items for when I get high level on this character. So it seems like Leah doesn't really believe what Deckard Kane is talking about, even though Deckard Kane is the man and he knows what is up. I've dug out a right good bunch of things for you this fine day. Three increased gold. Yeah, it's not really as good as the five armor, so I'll sell that, sell that. These are the best things that I have right now, so I'll keep those in case. I find another crossbow that I need, but let's see if they didn't have a crossbow. What a loser. What a noob. Okay. Good to know. Thanks, bro. The skeleton king was once our beloved lord, Leoric. Was driven mad by Diablo's evil. He lost both of his sons and his very soul before he was finally defeated. Now it seems he's risen to plague this land once again. A tragic story, but I cannot reach the fallen star until I face him. The key to defeating him lies in 
his old crowd. Seek out our blacksmith, Hadric. He knows of its whereabouts. Yeah, sorry, um, like, whenever the, um, somebody's talking, I try to get my mic close to the speaker so you can hear it better. But, you know. Damn it, Leah, you don't understand. You don't understand. Shit's going down. Alright, no worries. We're on a mission. She's a boss. That's all you need to know. Calm Dan. Blacksmith, Deckard Kane said you could help me find the crown of Leoric. Not now. It's my wife. She's locked in the cellar like all those who've been bitten. I have to put them all down. But how can I kill my own wife? Sometimes death is the only mercy we have left. I will help you. Thank you. Follow me. Thank you for helping me kill my wife. How do I run around in heels? Well, don't worry about it. Hatred. I run out pretty quickly. Fast regenerating source used to feel the demon hunter's offensive abilities. Resource regenerating slowly over time used for the tactical abilities. Okay. Going for an achievement here. Yeah, he won't be able to kill her the whole way. I'm just gonna let him lay the killing blow. There we go. So, yeah, that achievement. Uh, let Hadrig Eamon strike the killing blow. Okay. Yeah. Thick bracers and a club. Let's see. Um, better bracers. Useless club. Will do, bro. I just need to um, investigate this place. You know, see if there's any, you know, weird, unusual, free items laying around. Doesn't look like it. Fire. There's a big pack coming this time. 
Uh oh. Eat my. That was easy. <coughs> but that was the last of them, apparently. You can pause those if you want. I did once meet a raggedy fellow who claimed that he had trained one of the beasts to bring him large rats to eat. But I'm sure the story is utter nonsense. How can you be so sure? Sure. 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 Shire. Hmm. Huh. This is where. Sorry about the frames again. I, I Fraps likes to slow down my 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 system. Wow, did he teleport to me? Yep. Okay, I was gonna say it was hitting me, but the lag is really killing me. The frames. Okay. Well. I got a new arrow. So let's check that out. Ruin. Increase the chance of the arrow to pierce by 50%. Can't go wrong. Yeah. I keep forgetting about this. Like, I keep trying to hit spacebar for it for some reason. I don't know why. It's Q. Gotta remember that. Q, 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 Q. But yeah, Diablo 3 is a really fun game. I suggest you pick it up. During the last days of King Leoric's reign, even the skeletons of the ancient dead could not rest. They took up their broken armor and weapons once more, ready to cut down anything that yet drew breath. Though wasted and fragile, these creatures possess a twisted cleverness that makes them quite formidable. The cold ground welcomes the foul bodies of these cruel men. They sought to prolong their lives through forbidden magic at great and cruel cost to others. Their evil fed on itself until it consumed them all, and they found themselves at the end of a hangman's rope. That was like a read along. It's pretty pretty cool. <coughs> um yeah. So I don't know when the the parts won't will not be like I won't say, oh, end of part two or whatever, because I have no idea. I'm just gonna record a shit ton and then put it all into the editing software and then cut out sections and render them separately. So I will not have any idea what's going on? My hatred is too low. Please, you feel bitch. Um, yeah, they're the same, so. Yeah, one thing you gotta know about Diablo, you have to check every inch of the map, because it could be a book, or an item, or money, or enemies. these things. I 
really like playing ranged characters. Um, the Witch Doctor was really fun. Increased gold pickup is not worth the, the loss in armor. Especially at this point when I'm f still figuring out how this this girl plays. <coughs> so this may or be may or not be like three parts already. Um, Really? Get away from me. Uh, I don't want to run back into another enemy swarm just yet. Um. One thing I like about the Demon Hunter is I know that all other weapons are useful, useless to me except bows, so... Kind of makes it easier to decide what to pick up. It's like no daggers unless they're magic for selling, and um, rares sell them on the auction house. You know, um, some people are probably gonna make a job out of this game because the real money auction house comes out. They're just gonna probably go through the game like repeatedly for legendary items and sell them on the auction house for like thirty bucks each or something like that. And then yeah, they're just gonna make a job out of playing Diablo three. Which would be pretty cool, I mean. I love video games. I'd love to do it as a career, you know. I think I'm good enough to perhaps become a professional LOL player, but I need a better team. Um, and, you know, because team synergy is all is what LOL is all about. You don't need to be a professional yourself. As long as you have a good team, you can win games. Oh, dead villager. <laughs> Ooh, a dead villager. Uh oh. I love that impale ability. You just chuck a dagger and it's so cool because it goes right through their head and you're just like, yes. Just chuck a dagger through your skull. So I think I'm going to end the videos or like this, this, like I'm going to stop playing after this, um, the next checkpoint. Okay, now I know where I need to go up there, so I'm going to look around some more. Um, yeah, so I still have like this whole section to explore. Hmm. It's up here. Ooh, five gold. I'm rich. I don't know what that achievement was. I think it was for hitting these, destroying so many of these in a row at, in a certain amount of time. Or maybe it's just for destroying them, period. I can't be sure. Might as well kill all the guys here. Oh, 
I love this this uh this I wanna say champion character hero yes I don't know character character works so anyway I'm gonna go investigate what we missed down here <coughs> look at this we missed we missed this seven gold how could we go on without it right cool if it passes through them because then it'll just turn back around like my my arrows are like magical and they target they seek out their heat seeking but um yeah so let's go up this way then I go around the edges and then I move inward. It's kind of how I do things. I like to know the edge of the map. That way I can tell where I've been within it. It's quiet. Too quiet. Oh. That's right, I fucking wanted that shit. Get it? I'm talking about the movie. I didn't want to kill them, though I did. I was talking about how I made my my arrow curve bend at my will. See chest. It's always cool stuff around the edges of the One thing I don't like about Diablo 3 though, um, you need an internet connection to play it. You need to be online to play this game. It's really stupid, even single player, you have to be online. It's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. And, you know, it's, you can't, like, what if your internet's down? You can't play Diablo 3. What if, what if you move away and you don't have internet for a while? You just want to play some Diablo, you can't play Diablo 3. Like, I don't know. Sorry, but Blizzard fucked up there. Like, they're retarded. They're like, oh. We don't want people pirating it and stuff. People will find a way, alright? Regardless of what you do to stop it, people will find a way because that's what people do. We're hardwired to figure stuff out. There's people working around the clock to figure out how to pirate this game, I can guarantee it. I don't blame them. DRM is retarded and I think... I think Blizzard needs to get shown a thing or two about how stupid that is. If people are unsatisfied with your game, that's not good as a company. Like, it's a fun game, but if you can't play it because you don't have internet, that's unsatisfaction. Um, and you should be scolded for that. Just saying. Okay, so we missed this whole womb area over here, the, the womb of the map, as I call it. Oh.
Yeah, but I'm putting them into like 15 to 20 minute parts because it's really easy. Well, not really easy, but it's easier to upload those kind of things. I don't know. It's e it's easier to upload. Pale rune. Okay, that's good. Player health bars are disabled. Player health bars are enabled. I actually hit the D key instead of the S key. Impale has a 65% chance to knock the target back and stun. Oh, that's nice. 65% is more than half, so... I'm no math whiz, but... I'm guessing that means it'll happen more often than not. In theory. Uh, not worth it. And by that I mean like it's not worth it to just miss out on like five or six armor for the increased golden health got by two yards. It's just not smart at this point. If it was like increased experience or something like that, then maybe I'd still keep the seven armor glove um, boots, but at this point it's just not worth it. Oh shit. Three stuns in a row, so seems like it's pretty common. So as you can see we've done the entire map except for here and that area which is where we need to go so start moving up there what I don't like is um, I'm used to League of Legends so like you know movable camera but you can't have that in Diablo it wants you to keep your camera on your character so you know it also gets confusing because left click is to move and stuff whereas League of Legends is right click so like I found myself playing League of Legends or this game afterwards and like mixing it up and then in League of Legends, I'd be left clicking and be like, why am I not moving? <laughs> okay, so that's where we need to go. I don't want to end the video on you guys just yet. Um, leave a comment. Let me know if you want me to edit out, like, for next time, if you want me to edit out the, um, you know, the, the foraging scenes where I go around and look for all the items, because, like, I do that for every area, because I have to, because it's, like, hardwired to my brain, I need to find shit. And that's Diablo, you know, you need to be explorative like that, because that's what gives you your most gameplay value there, that's, that's where most of the game comes from, is searching around and exploring, finding dungeons, finding items, finding books. So. Let's go down here. Um, the villager. Nothing. Kind of look through here. Kind of go through here, and then we'll double back around and get the checkpoint, and then the videos will be over for until next time. All right. Um, thanks for watching. I don't know what part this is, but uh, stay tuned to my channel for more episodes of this. Subscribe, like the video, and favorite it, because it really helps me out. And um, once I hit 500 subscribers, I'll start uploading videos more frequently. That's kind of like a personal goal of mine. And I recently got like 40 subscribers in like the last four or five days because of my Darius video. So thanks a lot for that if you were part of that group. Um, like the video, favorite, subscribe, uh, follow me on Twitter, link in the description. Um, I have a link to Blizzard's page in the description so you can buy Diablo 3 online if you want. And, you know, thanks for watching and have a great day. See you later.